Hey, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you a 12 minute Tabata HIIT workout that is all body weight, no equipment needed, and you are going to burn fat and get in a great cardio workout in just 12 minutes. If you like this video, make sure you give it a like, subscribe to my channel, and of course, hit that bell to be notified so you don't miss out on new workouts every single week. It's a Tabata style workout, so we've got eight different exercises. We're gonna work for 20 seconds and then rest for 10 seconds between exercises for a total of three rounds of the entire circuit. If you wanna do a quick five minute dynamic warm up before starting this intense workout, check the link in the description. I'll put a link to a quick five minute dynamic movement session to warm your body up before you get started. Make sure you push as hard as you can in those 20 seconds of work and listen up because I'm coming along with you guys with modifications for some of the harder exercises to make each of them work for you. We are starting in three, two, one. Okay, first exercise is a basic high knees running on the spot. The higher your knees, the faster you go, the more you're gonna get out of the workout, but you can always modify this to just running on the spot, keeping your knees a bit lower. Exercise number two, bear position plank row. Go as fast as you can while still maintaining control of your core and no rotation through your hips. To make this one a little bit easier, keep your knees on the ground, not up in the air as I'm doing in the video here. Exercise number three, reverse lunge to knee drive. Really make sure you're driving through that front heel and pressing it into the floor, activating that glute as you're coming up in each exercise. And of course, go as fast as you can. Up next, we've got breakdancer push-ups. If you need to pause the screen to really see what I'm doing here, go for it. If not, we're doing a push-up with a kick through to add a little bit more core. If you need to drop to your knees for your push-up, that's totally fine. Okay, we're back up to our reverse lunge to a knee drive with your right leg in front now. Again, going as fast as you can while keeping control and really firing through that front heel and squeezing your right glute on the way up. Yep, you knew there was gonna be burpees in this workout somewhere. So here we are, burpee down to a hip open, so meaning you're just bringing one leg as high as you can towards your elbow, keeping your core nice and tight, and back up for your burpee. Okay, we're laying on our back. The next one is a bicycle crunch. With every third one, you're going to do a slight stall. So it should go one, two, stall. One, two, stall. Again, going as fast as you can, squeezing your abs and pressing your back into the floor. I can't be the one that you need. Yeah, you know what I've done in the past. Still you say you and I, we can last. I have found new. Okay, last exercise for the first round, UFC into a squat jump, meaning we are dropping one knee down, alternating each leg as you go. If you can't do the squat jump or the tuck jump at the top, just stand up and go right back down into your UFC. Maybe if I change the way I love it. Maybe if I try to fix this heart then. 
Okay, round one complete. We are starting round two. We are back to our high knees. Now that you're warm, let's really push and get the most out of this 20 seconds. Here we go. Let's drop back down to our knees for that bear position plank row. Remember, make sure your wrists are right underneath your shoulders, driving your elbows up, squeezing your upper back muscles and not letting those hips rotate. The faster you go, the better. Okay, back to our reverse lunge to a knee drive with your left leg in front. If you want to add a jump here to make it a little bit harder, feel free. I wouldn't be mad at you. Okay, back down for our break dancer push up. If these ones get a little bit too difficult, feel free to just drop to your knees and do regular push ups for as many reps as you can. Okay, let's get back up for our reverse lunge again with our right leg in front. Again, watch me on the screen and I want you to try and go faster than I'm going on the screen. And of course, here we are back to our burpees. Let's try and go for reps. Keep your form good, but let's push ourselves and try and get as many as you can. It's only 20 seconds, guys. You get to lay down, great news, bicycle crunch. Here we go, every third one, just a slight stall and really push yourselves, try and go as fast as you can while still maintaining core control. Here we go, back to our UFC to either a tuck jump, a squat jump, or no jump at all. If you find these ones are a little bit hard on your knees, feel free to just do body weight air squats as fast as you can. Here we go, last round already. We are back to our high knees and the last and final time you have to do this exercise. Here we go as fast as you can. Let's really push. Down to your hands and knees, bear position plank row. As you get tired, really focus on form. If you have to slow down a little bit, that is fine, but push yourself as hard as you possibly can.
Okay, let's get back up. Last round of this reverse lunge to a knee drive with your left leg in front. Again, if you wanna add a jump for your last set, it's only 20 seconds. Let's do this. Okay, we're back to our breakdancer push-ups. This is your last set. I really want you guys to dig deep as you get tired, get as low as you can in those push-ups and really challenge yourself here. Here we go. Act like we're gonna be friends. There's the fire. Take me higher. Leave it all over again. All over again. We're back to our reverse lunge with a knee drive, right leg is in front. Let's really push ourselves, drive through that heel and squeeze your glute and go fast, fast, fast. Act like we're gonna be friends. There's a fire, take me higher. Leave it all over again, all over again. Okay, only a few more exercises here. I know you're tired, but it's so worth it. Keep pushing yourselves. Let's crush this last set, I promise, last set of burpees. Here we go. Only two exercises left. Here we go. We're back to our bicycle crunch with the one, two stall. Really get the most out of this workout. Go as fast as you can. Squeeze those abs. Okay, we're back to our UFCs. The last 20 seconds of the workout. I know you're tired. I know you're gonna wanna quit, but I believe in you. Let's push the last 20 seconds of work right till that last buzzer goes. Here we go. complete there you go guys I hope you enjoyed this 12 minute Tabata hit workout you burned a lot of fat blasted a lot of calories and come back to this workout when you're short on time but you want a good sweat make sure you follow me on social media for daily motivation fitness and fat loss tips and check out my website for more information about online personal training or how I can help you on your fitness and fat loss goals if you're not already subscribed of course subscribe to my channel give this video a like and leave me a comment let me know how you enjoyed it and check out some of the other workouts already on my channel, all body weight from 12 minutes to 30 minutes. I've got something for everyone. And again, thank you guys so much for working out with me today. And I look forward to seeing you in the next one. You should be proud of yourselves. Now go stretch and get some water.